Um, I, I'm going to start doing a new series of videos. And to be honest, these are the videos that I really intended to do when I first started this channel. Um, this channel is called uh, Wrestling with the Angel, which is intended to imply or talk about the meeting space between Jews and Christians, which is a really interesting place that I've been hanging out in for the last seven years. But I've been writing for much longer than that. Um, so I'll tell you a story. When I was 12 years old, I moved. I met Howie Friedman. He was my new neighbor. Um, my family moved to New Jersey. And Howie Friedman introduced me to marijuana. And we used to hang out and get wheelchair, meaning we would just get, we couldn't even stand up. And we'd hang out in his um, TV room, watch HBO, which was a new thing at that time, cable television, eat mustard sandwiches and just become vegetative. And one day his mom walked in and I was 12 years old and she looked at me and she said, is this what you're going to do with your life? And I looked up and I said, no, I'm going to be in a, a novelist and write, write great books. I don't. I had no idea where that came from. I think that a lot of people have a bit of prophecy and they know where their life is going to go. Um, the question is whether or not you realize it, um, whether you actualize it. And I didn't start writing until I was, actually until I, I moved to Israel and very quickly within six months wrote my first full-length novel, uh, which is kind of stunning. I didn't take time off to do it. I just did it. Um, it was a very early laptop. It was in 1991. So I've been writing ever since. I Thank God I've, uh, Shimon Apostorf published one of my books called The Hope Merchant. Um, I put together a collection of short stories called Dolphins on the Moon. And I have a book that was put out by Root Source Publishing called, um, called, Master of Return in the 11th Light. But I've because I've been so busy writing, I haven't been writing, meaning I've been writing articles for Israel 365. I haven't written. And I'd like to get back into writing. And to be honest, like I said, the reason why I started this channel um, and started doing videos was to promote my books, to make people familiar with my books. I realized early on, Prayer is a powerful thing, but you have to be careful with it. Um, I kept praying, I want to be a writer, I want to be a writer. And like in The Wizard of Oz, boom, I'm a writer, but that's not really what I wanted. Um, what I wanted was I wanted people to read my stories, people to become familiar with my stories. Um, I love when people come up to me and say, gee, I loved when you said this in your in your story and it meant this to me and this to me. And I'm like, did it? Wow, I had no idea what it meant until they told me. And so I want to make people familiar with my writing and I want to get back into writing. And the only way to do that is to be active with it. So I'm going to start reading my fiction and talking about writing. So if you so I'm going to start doing this as recorded videos, but if you want to have, you know, some kind of interactive uh, video where I talk to people about their writing, talk to them about my writing and the writing process. Um, I I really love that. I think I think God loves stories, and He created the world so that there would be um, so many people living those stories. And then He looks at them and He says, "Ah, that's the story I meant." And I think that's why we're here. So let's do it. Let's do it. Uh, what I'd like to recommend is something that I've stopped doing because of my cell phone, which I should start doing again, as I always used to walk around with either with, with a small journal and just those thoughts, the grains of sand, and eventually you create an entire an entire beach, an entire, you know, each 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 note you make to yourself is a new feature in the desert. And it's it's wonderful. Um and I also I have what's like what I call um, story seeds, which I'll have an idea for a story and I just quick outline, two page outline, and I've got a whole novel waiting to be written. Also, um, a lot of authors experience this. I don't write. I take dictation. I, I always talk about the voices. 
um, a voice will come to me and tell me a story and I've, and I've got to work it out. My wife knows that I'll get a look at that look on my face and I'll just be like, mm. and the story will be playing out in my head. And the problem is it's a story that had to come into the world and it came first to you. And if you don't do it, it's gone. And it's so important that we write, that we, that we tell these stories, that we write these stories. So that's what I'm going to try to do. And God willing, I mean, I call it my, 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 my bucket books. Um, people have a bucket list of what they want to do before they leave the world. I have bucket books, books that not only I want to write, but books that I'm required to write before I leave this world. So I'd like to include you in that process um, of bucket books. So I'll be reading stories. Um, and it's also the best way to edit for me is to read a story. So it might not be an incredibly pleasant video to watch because I'll be stopping and editing as I read it. And maybe I'll, I should edit those things out. Um, and, and go back and edit them uh, so that you don't have to suffer through the video. So I'll try to do that. Um, I've got to figure out a way to do that. Anyway, thanks so much. Hopefully, also, if you like the books that are on Amazon, if you want an electronic copy, send me an email. I'll, I'll be happy to send you um, electronic files of of my stories, because like I said, I don't want to be a great author. I want to have wonderful readers. Um, this connection, this community, I've, I've connected with so many really wonderful people. So if you want an electronic copy, it doesn't cost me anything. It doesn't cost you anything. Um, shoot me an email. I'll put the email down below. Um, if you feel like you don't want to buy the book, but you want to help me out, you can, uh, my PayPal is down below. You can send me you know, whatever you want to, whatever you want to send me. And if you don't, I'm also okay with that. Um, God is taking care of me. My kids are fed and clothed. And um, I, I thank God I, 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 I have an income. Um, so, but gifts are, gifts are beautiful. Um, so we'll be in touch. God willing. Thank you so much.